So Corey's making something like chilaquiles. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I was trying to use up what we have, like leftovers and stuff. So that's it with a little bit of milk. It's a lot seasoning. of milk, actually. <laughs> <laughs> and then, because uh, we have some limes, so I want to use the limes. And then we have tortillas that are left over. And then I had already thawed out this meat, breakfast sausage meat. So I figured I would make gravy, and then we can use it on, you know, potatoes or something like that. But I was like, shoot, I'll make some, whatever these are called. Yeah, and then we have the spaghetti sauce, so she might put a little bit of that yeah. in there. Just because it's, you know, you need some kind of that red sauce, but... Why not? Why not? We got spaghetti sauce, so we'll do <laughs> what we got, and it'll taste good. If you don't like it, get used to it. Yep. If you don't like it, you'll get used to it. Yeah, baby. Okay, okay. Put some seasonings in here already. Plus, it's breakfast sausage, so it's already already gone. Yeah, I know this isn't a part of my keto as far as the tortillas, but we had some left over, so I might as well eat them. We have some in the fridge. <laughs> so that's good. Let that cook up a little bit. Add the sauce in a minute. Alright. We'll try on the little side. Gonna bring it down. Yeah, because it's going to start popping. Alright, so we're going to put a little bit here. Mm. We're going to try it. Let's see. And of course, going to just do a little bit to see if she likes it with this sauce. Yeah. Try it Oh yeah, that's good. All right. Took quite a bit. All right, let's try that. Mm -hmm. Put it on low heat right now. Drop the mix and add this and everything. Some cheese. You gotta put some parmesan cheese. Yeah, we got parmesan cheese. Mm -hmm. Look good. Mm -hmm. All right. <laughs> Try that a little bit. All right, y'all. I'm gonna make this Jello, strawberry Jello. So I got a cup right here of water that I'm going to boil. And since we have a bag of strawberries, I'm going to um, dice up or slice up some strawberries and put it in the jello too. Plus, y'all, I get to use my new to me Pyrex container, which I used it already to make cake, the muffin mix. And it is it's just beautiful. It's a beautiful shape. Look at that. That is very cool. So, let me get to. Dicing and slicing. Okay, it's boiling. Shut this off. Okay. It's been a long time since I made jello. So what you do is mix it until it all dissolves. It's pretty quick too. I think that's it. So what I'm going to do is keep slicing here. So I started slicing but all it does is like, oh crap. Bloopers. 
don't know about you guys, but I'll rinse it and eat it. I don't care. That's good enough. what it looks like in the in the daylight it's kind of dark in this kitchen all right let's try it again it's kind of the same I figured I'd go ahead and do it today because we don't really have that much in the fridge right now. So this will fit perfectly. So this is what I got right now. And I can put this down here. I made some uh, sausage gravy with some peas. You guys can see the little green, green spots there. And it's got that tray there. I have to move the tray. Hold on. Well, girl, you want strawberries? <laughs> yeah, buddy, you want some strawberries. All right, y'all, let's check on it. It's done. Yeah, buddy. All right, I'm going to put this back in here and put that Ooh. tray back in. I need to thaw this out. One of these days, I'll do that. But look at this. Mm -hmm. How cool is that?